Hola. How you doing calling me so early for? Mijo, if you talk to your mother like that otra vez, I will personally reach through this phone and stick my hand up your ass. Your foot, Papa. You'll stick your foot up my ass. What? Mijito, living in that big city has taught you to forget how to talk to your parents, no? I'm sorry. Where are my manners? May I ask why you two are calling me so early? 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 It's a work day. We always told you waking up at 6 a.m. is slacking. You should be out the door and ready to jump on the day. Oh, don't listen to your father. You know how militant he is. We were just so excited. We had to call our only son and tell him we're coming in this week. What? I mean, uh, why is that? To see you, mijito. To make sure you're not falling behind in that big city. Okay. Do I need to put you two up somewhere? Mira, mi mas. Put us where? No, senor. We're staying with you and your new roommate. Oh, no, I, uh, okay, fine. When? Thursday evening, but our flight doesn't get to Austin till 11 p.m. Okay, Mama, I'll see you two then, but now I gotta get ready for work. Bye. Are you, are you dating anyone? Can that, con Hello? Hello? Con I what? Five ninety five for a monthly membership to the gym? Y'all out of y'all mind. Who can afford that? Time out called on the court and we'll be back shortly after this commercial break. I can work out here. So you want to look like this guy. You want the ladies to wash their clothes on your ass, don't you? Ah, uh, you want to speak to the ladies with your chest. <laughs> oh, art. You just want to look like this guy. We know. Then buy the Rattle Rocker now for $9.95 at this number. $9.95? What? Hello, Rattle Rocker? Thank you for your interest in our product. Are you ready to start rocking today? Yeah, yeah. I'd like to buy one Rattle Rocker, please. I, do you guys take cash? No, sir. For that, you'll have to visit a BBS store. Any BBS store? Yes. Thanks. Uh, bye. Breathe, breathe, breathe. What, what time is it? Don't forget to breathe. I don't know, like 11? What are you doing working out at 11 p.m.? A few more. Look, Jay, a bite like this doesn't work itself out, okay? It takes hard work and sweat to sculpt this masterpiece there. Weird. Feel the burn. You can do it. What are you doing in those ridiculous pajamas anyway? It's 11. Almost there. It's my thing. And I like to have a can of mellow out before I go to bed. Helps me relax. Don't give up. Go to bed? Come on. Louis, you should be ready to go out at this time. Oh, no, 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 no. I need rest and relaxation each night so I can be efficient and on time the next day. Ten more seconds. All right, well, I'll talk to you later about this, but 
No, I'm, I'm about to hit this though. Four, three, Whatever. two, one, good. You were close on this one, Yosef, but I found an opportunity to use the Excel formulas I learned in college to enhance the data you collected on the more reports. Hmm. Thanks, Gina. Oh. This is brilliant. I really appreciate your work. You'll have to show me how the Excel formulas work so I can see if I can improve it. No problem. As your assistant, it's my job to fix any mistakes you have. Mistakes? Uh, I beg to differ. There you are. Me? Yes, you. I mean, look at you, champ. Look at you with your nice shirt, your nice jacket, your nice shoes. You look good. Hmm. Thanks. Yeah. Hey, look, our boss Mike wants to talk to you about tomorrow's meeting, okay? Oh. He, he does? Well, of course he does. You're the champ around here. You're the hero. He wants to make sure that his best man for the job is ready to go. Now go. Go, okay. get going. Oh, okay, right now. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Ciao, Bella. Huh? Oh, Gina. Gina, Gina, Gina. You amaze me every day with your beauty. <laughs> I'm sure you say that to all uh -huh. girls. Only to those who deserve it. And you, my Bella. The reason why I wake up every day is mesmerized by you. <laughs> um, it's getting hot in here. I, um... I better get back to work. Yes, go. Go, Benissima, go before we make fireworks. Side to side. Keep a tight core. Stay tight. Up and down. Get those washboard abs. All right. First, I want to thank you for making it to the meeting on time. It's about time. As you all know, we have a very important meeting tomorrow with a client. This meeting is exceptionally important for our firm. So today, I want you to go through all the data. I want you to go through all the revisions and you keep me informed of any issues, situations, or concerns that may arise, okay? All right, good. So we're gonna begin with Joseph here as he has the latest projections on our forecast and the potential revenue for our client. So Joseph, it's all yours. Thank you, Mike. Um, I, I just want to say what a pleasure it is and how I really appreciate your, your wisdom and input. And I'm really honored to be in front of everyone. Facts! Facts! All right, I don't care about your personal needs or how you're feeling. We are on the verge of a big deal. Okay? A big deal. So all I want is small... Simple answers and facts. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, sir. That, that, that won't happen again, sir. I, I'm, I'm really facts. <sighs> well, um, the total available market for more enterprises is roughly two point four million units per year. Um, the total operating cost will be 3.1 million. But we must factor the natural raises the employees involved will get, plus your fat selling bonus, sir. <laughs> so our true cost will actually be $4 million. All right. Uh, but there will be ways that we can get that down to 3.5 million, which means the company will save $10.8 million. And, and that's $6.8 million on the low side and $7.3 on the high side in one year. One year. Whoa. Uh, splendid job, Giovanni. Uh, Joseph, 
Well, whatever. I mean, if these facts are accurate, you both are good in my book. Wow. So, Giovanni, it appears you're on your A game. And since Joseph doesn't like to do these dinners due to his social awkwardness, you can go in his place. Well, I mean, only if Joseph sits. I would hate to feel like I'm stealing his work. Well... I, uh, I can't go because my parents are... I'll go, Mike, under one condition, though. All right, name it. Gina, Joseph's assistant. And she is very close to the project. Okay, Gina, I need you to clear your schedule. I don't care what you have. All right, we need you there. I, um... I, um... I can go. Okay, Mm -hmm. great. I'll be there. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Don't forget to breathe. Up and down. Up and down. You know, Sean, we've been roommates for five days, four nights, 18 hours, 42 minutes, and 52 seconds. Keep it going. Wow. If you applied yourself at work the way you apply your workout routine, you you may just have something going for you. I mean, you you say you want to apply yourself at work. Maybe if you didn't work out so late and adopted the same attitude, you can work your way out of the mailroom. Anyway, I may be home late tomorrow, but it won't matter because you'll be in What did you, you, you sure as hell won't be home late due to a girl? I mean, the only thing you date are your Excel spreadsheets in your library. Okay, so don't sit here and give me advice about how to do what I do. Okay? You know, you really really should take a step back and look at yourself before you try and judge me, Yosef. I mean, when was the last time you applied your work habits to getting a girl? Asshole. Oh, you saying about tomorrow night? Eat shit, Sean! A few more. One sec, I have to take this. Ma? Huh? We just landed in Dallas and should be there on time at Austin at 11 p.m. Son, what is that ruckus I hear back there? Are you gonna be home? Maybe, Dad. Probably right after you both arrive. I'm here at a dinner meeting. At a bar. How are we supposed to get in? I left the key under the mat. Anyways, you were saying about tomorrow night? Okay, uh, I have to get back to work now. Okay, bye. Still burn. Still burn. John? It's me, Yosef. Your roommate. Do you remember me? We became roommates six days, five nights, 18 hours, and 25 seconds ago. I I think you saved my number by now. 
A anyway, I'm calling because last night I forgot to tell you. Well, I didn't forget. We had an argument and I got mad and, well, whatever. My parents are coming to town at 11 p.m. Just be decent when you get when they get there and show them their spare room. They can be on their own from there. Oh, and uh, don't work out tonight. They'll think it's weird. Okay, thanks. Bye. How is it? 10.30. Time to get ready for this workout. So he's been working for 18 hours and he calls about the argument we had. How does he expect me to be decent to him if he's always a jerk to me? The motherfucker's got some nerve. Squeeze those glutes. Squeeze those pecs. Keep it going. Keep rocking. Feel the burn. Yeah. Feel the burn, baby. Keep it firm. A few more. Rattle! What for Chino? 